The Apple Pencil is also excellent for annotating and marking up documents, photos, or in this case, a PDF. Anytime you see the pencil icon at the top of the screen, you can tap on that to open up your drawing tools. And this can be a great support to teachers and students with note making activities by going through any document and picking out key ideas or words. This can be great for annotating poems or any other text that you might be studying as part of a classroom activity. Again, look for the pencil option at the top of the screen and that will open up the drawing tools. So here I'm just going to use the green highlighter option to pick out the examples of repetition and highlight the use of the word 14 throughout this sonnet by Robert Burns. And I could then swap over to my pen and use that to label up the rhyme scheme of the sonnet to highlight that aspect of the poem to students. This could be great as part of a live lesson or a screen record and at the end of marking up the PDF I can save it so that the ink marks remain. You can mark up a photo or an image by tapping on edit at the top right and tapping on the ellipsis at the top of the screen and then selecting markup and that will open up the drawing tools sidebar and from here you can use any pen, pencil or colour that you choose in order to correctly label up a diagram. And again, this could be great as part of a live lesson or a screen record to help students understand a particular aspect of the curriculum. And you can move that toolbar across the screen by simply sliding it across with your finger. For this photo, I am again going to tap on Edit and the ellipsis and select Markup. And the first thing I want to do is select the white pen to wipe away this green box at the top of the image. I'm now going to press on the plus icon on the drawing toolbar and text and that will allow me to add a text box and from here I can change the text size and the font type and that will then allow me to type in any words that I want into the text box. Now that I have the text boxes in place, I'm going to use the pen to handwrite and label up the rest of the diagram. And I can then change the colour of the text in the text boxes to match the colours in the rest of the labels.